What is going on everyone and welcome back to the Ghouls Gaming and Tech channel. We know on this channel we cover a wide array of things, mostly centered around gaming and tech and we've covered some of this stuff before and I'm talking about Lucid Motors. Now apparently they dropped or announced a new vehicle. You know there's been tons of controversy around Lucid, their stock completely plummeted from where it started and people weren't too convinced it's a great product but the prices don't match with you know them being a starter company and they're supposed to be competing with tesla and they're pricing things at astronomical prices that we don't agree with but they are announcing a new car for what reason i don't know but you know so we're going to check out this trailer and then we're also going to go on the lucid website to see you know the configurations and how much this costs because i'm pretty sure in this trailer they are not going to show how much this car costs and I'm willing to bet it's going to start off between $74,000 and $86,000. Um, I think this is an SUV so uh, we're going to check out this really quick. If you're new, subscribe and if you're new or returning, make sure to hit that like button. It's definitely appreciated. So I'm going to be honest, first impression, it kind of looks like a van a little bit but you can tell it's definitely an SUV but it, it kind of looks like a van. I don't know if they were going for that. The, the interior setup is a little bit different. The the dash across is the same, but the uh, center uh, display is different. Yeah, it looks like a little van, a little spaceship van. Oh, you can change the suspension on it. Okay, okay, okay. You got the canopy roof still. Um, That trunk space looks a little bit worrisome. You got a little fender on the back for aerodynamics. A huge front trunk space. That is massive. You can fit two people in there. That's massive. I mean, the design overall, the design is nice. It it looks nice. It just kind of vanished looking. 419 miles, and that wasn't even on a full charge. Okay. All right, so we're going to swing over to the website and see how much this is priced for. All right, so we're on the Lucid website. We clicked on the Gravity page, which is what this SUV is going to be called, the Lucid Gravity. So it says projected range over 440 miles. That's a lot. Uh, peak power over 800 horsepower, seating up to 7, 0 to 60 in 3.5 seconds. So this thing is an SUV, but it is moving like holy crap, dude. Uh, I'm pretty, I don't, I want to know if that's the, um, like the super upgraded speed. Like if you get the highest costing vehicle, like is that the one that goes 3.5 or is it more? So they're showing pictures uh, from the little video ad that we just watched massive front trunk space which i think is a huge plus so yeah this is the interior that i was speaking about so i like the design of the seats i can see this little cutout design or it's not a cutout but this little design material on the seats uh they're designed pretty good again i think the brown color is like an upgraded you know feature which you'll have to pay extra for the center display is kind of similar to the tesla one um i don't know if i can zoom in here yeah i can zoom in this center display right here is similar to the Tesla display, but it looks like this one's more at an angle tilted up and it looks like they might have some physical controls down here, which is good. You can stay informed and it says view the launch. I think that's the view the launch. I think that's just the trailer. So let's see what the stay informed is. It says leasing offers. If you look up here, leasing offers start at $749 per month for 36 months offer details because I, I that's what i want to know i want to know how much this costs we can get any more information elevate adventure stay informed blah 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 yeah where's the price though okay so we get some better pictures so the steering wheel looks pretty standard from the other lucid vehicles um this center console like pull out thing what is that i don't know i wonder what that material is, is that see-through I don't know, but that looks cool. Let's see. What is this? It looks like it has cup holder, cup holders in the inside. I don't know. I don't know if that's a visual effect or what. Seems like it's pretty spacious, but obviously this is a wide angle, so it's going to look that way. But yeah, the design is nice. Seats are nice. The, you know, these cars are, are not bad looking. They are great looking. Uh, it's just the price. The price is the only thing that I would be concerned with. I mean, where is the price? 
seven around eight cubic feet and uh, eight cubic feet trunk. Three 120 volt batteries, six USB C ports, long distance lightning speed. Again, this elongated display right here at the top, your where your instrument cluster would be. Yeah, again, it looks nice. It looks nice. I wouldn't be opposed. Like if I was a family guy and I had like a big family, I would get this. It's like a van, but not a van. All right, let's see. View the launch. Lucid gravity redefining the electric SUV. So this is all everything. I don't want to read through all this because it's going to be, you know, mind numbing to read all those details. I'm just trying to see if there is a price. Let's see. Control F. Maybe command F. There we go. Um, boom. Let's see. There we go. Lucid gravity right here. Lucid gravity lands in late 2024. As with Lucid Air, pricing for gravity will start at $80,000. So, you know, I'm not going to give this price crap because it is an SUV. SUVs typically cost a little bit more, being that this is a full size SUV, has tons of space. It is the starting price. I would feel more comfortable if it started about $67,000, $13,000 difference, uh, but that's just me. $67,000, I think that is a good, you know, happy medium to start this car off at, but $80,000, it's a little bit too pricey for me, but I can understand it. Um, I think most SUVs in that similar market are somewhere close to that, but uh, again, I still think it's a tad bit too price, uh, overpriced, a little bit by like thirteen thousand dollars but overall my thoughts on it is the range is great the uh horsepower is great the speed of it is great the design is just the main thing it looks phenomenal i'm a big fan of the design i do i want lucid to come down on that price a little bit to help them sell more contrary to what some people may believe i want them to be successful um but yeah i think this will be a good a good one to ride on uh, ride around what do you guys think are you guys a big fan of lucid or, or no but yeah it's all right overall it's all right if I, again if i had like a big family i wouldn't be opposed to getting this so it's electric i'm all for it the design is great yeah and i think overall it looks better than the model y and the model x so it's a winner i'd say uh let me know what you guys think down in the comments below uh thanks for tuning in and i will see you in the next one peace